Hello everybody and welcome back. We are back at the Nelson Atkins Art Museum here in Kansas City, Missouri and we are headed to see the contemporary arts. We are in the Block Building and this building was built in 2007 and it not only houses the contemporary arts, it also houses the special exhibits. There's a new entrance, a coffee shop and a gift store as well. be honest I am not much into modern art it's because I don't understand most of it but I can appreciate it however this piece has me perplexed the plaque says that it's supposed to represent contemplation of a spiritual realm and I still don't get it so if any of you do please let me know fill me in The artist who created this piece, Claus Oldenburg, and his wife, Kuzi Van Bergen, created the much debated, much hated, much loved shuttlecocks that adorn the museum lawns. There is no denying that this is a Warhol. This is a portrait of Marion Block from 1975, and this building is named after her husband. Warhol created four canvases. Two are in the Warhol Museum. One is here, and one the family kept. I tell you what, I am so turned around here. Um, excuse me, can you tell me where the exit is, please? Sir? I'm just kidding. It's a statue. I knew it was a statue. I'm just joking. Now this piece I really like because it looks like a brush stroke frozen in time and three dimensional. It is really pretty. I wonder if it's comfortable. Well, look here, we have found a teapot and I just love this because it has such a surreal feel to it and I am really intrigued by its shape. And speaking of contemporary art, my brother is an artist, and his name is Jay Leon, and this is actually me, and it is part of his Color Diva series. He has his own gallery, it's called the Jay Leon Art Gallery, and it is down in Miramar Beach, Florida, and I absolutely love this. If you'd like to see more of the collection here at the Nelson Atkins Art Museum, go ahead and click the playlist because I cover a lot more than just the contemporary arts. Thank you guys for watching. I'll see you next week.